Hi, I'm David Golding. I've been buying and selling classic and modern cars here in Dublin since 1988. Here we have a 1994 Mercedes C140. It's the 600 SEC, 6 litre V12 automatic. Beautiful, beautiful condition throughout. This was reputedly one of the finest cars ever built, according to many. And this particular example is extremely good. Only a couple of hundred of these were made. A very, very rare beast. And certainly one to grace any Mercedes collector's collection. Inside the sumptuous interior is in excellent condition. Two-tone leather, fully electric memory seats, both passenger and driver. Beautiful high gloss lacquer on the veneers. Lovely beige carpets. Lumbar support adjustment here on the seat. She's electric sunroof. And moving into the back. Perfect condition. Again, lots of wood, electrically adjustable seats. Holding rear headrests and the first aid kit is present there. Bristling with technology. It's got the rear view blind, electrically adjusted. The seat belt valets can be put out with the switch and the rear headrest dropped here. She's got four electric windows, sports and economy gearbox. Here's the switch to adjust the mirrors, the wing mirrors that are retractable. Turn it 180 degrees and you can use that switch to adjust the rear view mirror. A rare feature only found on the early years of these. She's got heated seats, the Becker Mercedes branded stereo, so you'll fabulous never sounds. Your no claims bonus if you have an accident or a claim is made against you. Dual climate control. She's got cruise control, half wood, half leather steering wheel, electrically adjustable steering column, and just 83,000 miles. Car comes with a lot of history enough to warrant this mileage. Cruise control and the parking sticks that extend in reverse. Again, a one year only feature. Double glazing in the drop glass and the comfort closing working. The remote central locking works on the key. Two alarm fobs, one in full working order. Electric tilt and slide sunroof, operated with the button here. The boot is very clean, all the original pieces here, the warning triangle, spare wheel, small tools and jack. And here is the main feature of this car, the 6 litre V12, reputedly producing over 400 brake horsepower. This is the same engine used to power the Pagani Zonda. In terms of maintenance, it's had the all-important wiring loom replaced recently. All seems to be well. And the bonnet liner is in good condition. Let's see how she drives. Starts promptly. She pulls away smoothly. Well, this car reputedly gives out over 400 horsepower. It's not a tire burning car. Very, very heavy. It's all about the smoothness. The car does most of its work around town at just over 1,000 RPM. I'm doing 40 now as we speak, 1,300 RPM. Silky smooth. On the motorway is where you see the power released. If you're doing 60, you want to overtake somebody, you have nearly unlimited power on top. It's in fabulous condition throughout. Everything's working. All the dials, instruments, switches, seatbelt bucklers, you name it. This car has it. Very, very high spec. Electric blinds on the rear. And it's one of the very early models that has the parking sticks that protrude out of the boot lid when you go into reverse. I believe this were only available for one year, along with the electrically adjustable self-dipping rear view mirror. Overkill if you like, when you can just easily flick a switch, but this is what you get when you're buying what is reputedly the best car in the world. Technology 
that was cutting edge in its day and still very impressive today. Double glazing, self-closing doors, you name it, this car has it. Really comfortable electric seats. It drives really well. So quiet in here with the double glazing. Light enough to handle. Low geared power steering. And this power brakes require a bit of getting used to. Once you get the feel for them, you'll stop the car in a sixpence. Highest quality materials used on this car from the suede headlining, the thick leather, two tone on the seats, half leather, half wood dash, the very high quality, high lacquer veneer, thick pile carpets. This car has it all, no less than you'd expect from what was one of the dearest cars in its day. A really good example, I believe only a couple of hundred of these were built and only a small proportion of those in right hand drive. They seem to represent extraordinarily good value today. They're a car that I'm sure can only go up in price. So much class, so much technology. All for the price of a good MGB. I'm delighted to be Trustpilot's highest rated car dealer in Ireland today.